So basically what we were doing here was um, just studying independent poker. We weren't actually sort of researching anything. Um, our end game was to basically get a better understanding of Texas Hold'em and um, you know how to play it. And uh, so we decided to sort of design an AI for a game um, where you can play against it. And it turns out Texas Hold'em is really hard to analyze mathematically. So um, basically what we did was we broke it down into a much simpler game and it, we um, the end result is basically you playing uh, one hand against a computer and it's just the final round of betting. So you just uh, you just get to better check against the computer and then they'll better check against you. And then if you win, you get chips. If you lose, you don't get chips. And um, this basically all kind of came from um, this paper, um, Computing Sequential Equilibria for Two-Player Games. They provided a lot of, uh, of the code already for the algorithm that they had used. So um, we just kind of took that integrated it in with a game that we had designed. It's all text-based. We could have made it GUI, which is, um, you know, graphics and stuff like that, but uh, it didn't have a lot of time. Kind of took most of the semester just to do, get this game kind of cranked out. But um, basically, uh, that's, that's the end result. And uh, if you look at the middle here, it's probably the most eye-catching piece of the poster. And uh, it basically is just a hand-ranking system. So if you're playing Texas Hold'em and you go all in before the flop, basically you have this percentage of chance of winning against some random hand. So kind of get an idea of how strong your hand is before the flop if you want to take a look.